Quick Bible study, Rape and Soul Ties. Sex is spiritual, whether consent is given or it is taken by force. In either case, a soul tie is created and the two become one flesh. In order to fully understand the rape and soul tie dynamic, we must define force. According to rain.org, force doesn't always refer to physical pressure. Perpetrators may use emotional coercion, psychological force or manipulation to coerce a victim into non-consensual sex. Some perpetrators will use threats to force a victim to comply, such as threats to hurt the victim, withholding money, or threatening to cheat, along with other intimidation tactics. In 2 Samuel 13, 11, King David's son Amnon rapes his half-sister using the manipulation tactic of pretending to be sick and then blatantly ignoring her pleas for him not to force her. In verse 14, it says, however, he would not listen to her and being stronger than her, he overpowered her and forced her to lay with him. An earlier depiction of rape is recorded in Genesis 34 when Dinah, the daughter of Jacob and Leah, is forced to have intercourse Sin. with Shechem, the Hivite. Since sex is a spiritual act, whether consented or by force, the two, Dinah and Shechem, became one.